Innovation is at the core of what we do here at Worcester Bosch. We are fundamentally a product company and therefore investment in long-term product development is absolutely crucial to us continuing to supply high quality products to warm our customers' lives. We're also committed to a greener future and to decarbonising the way we heat our homes and buildings. And in our view, a decarbonised future is only possible via continuous investment in product, technology and innovation. We're also diversifying our product portfolio to ensure that we have products available that can decarbonise all of the different property types that we find here in the UK. I'm asked all the time, is the future of heating heat pumps or hydrogen boilers? And my answer is, it's actually both. And other technologies as well, such as hybrids and heat interface units. We're also involved in multiple trials to demonstrate and validate a number of different technologies to ensure we have options for the future. We're also heavily engaged in discussions with government to educate them, as well as installers and homeowners alike, on the options they have to decarbonise their homes. This is absolutely essential and we must all work together to build a long-term and sustainable future. As a leader in the heating industry, it's our responsibility to make changes now to protect the planet and future generations. In 2019, we commissioned the UK's first 100% hydrogen boiler demonstration and we continue to develop our award-winning hydrogen-ready technology. Hydrogen produces no carbon dioxide at point of use, nor does it generate carbon monoxide when it's burnt. So it could play a key role in reducing the carbon emissions of domestic homes with minimal disruption or cost. A hydrogen-ready boiler would provide a like-for-like -like replacement for an existing natural gas boiler reaching the end of its life. It could be installed and run on natural gas until hydrogen is available in the local gas network, at which point it's simply a matter of swapping a few components for the boiler to run on carbon-free hydrogen. Both ground and air source heat pumps are well suited to new build properties and therefore will most likely make their biggest contribution to low carbon heating in this market. This is because the house can be specified with a heat pump in mind from the beginning, given that radiators and pipework will need to be sized differently to accommodate the technology. A dedicated space for the hot water cylinder and the outdoor unit or even the ground loops can be provided. For existing homes, heat pumps will be better placed in a hybrid system. This is where a heat pump works for the majority of the year but a boiler is installed for support during the colder months. The main advantage of this technology is the reduced alterations required to both the existing heating and hot water system, as well as reduced alterations to the fabric of the property. For commercial developments, heat networks are becoming an increasingly desirable solution in the UK. Heat networks provide domestic hot water and heating to multiple properties, such as apartments, via a heat interface unit, which looks very much like a boiler and is situated in each apartment. The heat interface unit, or HIU, is then supplied from a centralised boiler, heat pump or hybrid plant room. This saves space, money and improves efficiency. We have our own BESA certified Greenstar HIUs already on the market today, along with our commercial boilers and heat pumps to provide a full system solution. Although 2050 may seem like a long way off, it is essential that as an industry we roll up our sleeves and take action now. We've all got to work together to reach a net zero carbon future and many of the solutions to get there are already available today.